Good morning, class. Okay, please stand for our prayer. Let's pray together. Okay, so in the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Dear Lord, be with us today as we have our lesson. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. In the name of the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, so good morning once again, everyone. Okay, so good morning. So before you sit down, please arrange your chairs properly and make it straight. Okay, very good. You may now sit down. Okay, so um, how are you, class? Oh, you, you, very good. You're doing fine. You're doing good. Okay, so I see a lot of smiling faces for today. Okay, so I, I think that you're excited for a lesson for today. Okay, that's good to hear. Okay, so now class, um, let's check your attendance. Okay, no one is absent for today. That's good to hear. Very good class. Clap your hands. Okay, so now before we start our lesson, I'm going to give you my classroom rules. I have five classroom rules and First is listen when your teacher is talking in front or when we have a discussion. Second is follow the direction carefully. Third is raise your hand when you want to say something. Okay? Fourth is my fourth rule is respect yourself and other people okay and last rules number five my fifth rule is be safe helpful and neat okay do you understand our classrooms class okay very good that's good to hear okay so now who can recall what was our last topic yesterday Okay, we have Michelle. Okay, very good. Our last topic yesterday is all about sentences. So we recognize simple sentences. Okay, now class. So today is the day that we learn something new. Are you all excited? Okay, very good. That's good to hear. So now I have an activity. So do you want an activity class? Okay, this is exciting. Okay, very good. So, I call this activity as give me my name. Okay, so what is what is this activity, ma'am? Okay, so listen to my instruction. So, I prepare here a random pictures. So, I want you to identify what is this pictures. Okay, so are you ready now, class? Okay, very good. So, let's start. Okay, first picture. What is this? Okay, that's correct. This is a girl. Okay, this is a girl. Another. Okay, this. What is this picture? Okay, very good. This is school. This is school. Okay, so another. Here. What is this picture? Okay, very good, Jell. This is a pencil. Okay. This is a pencil. Okay, so another is I have here. What is this picture? Okay, very good, Angel. This is chicken. Okay. Okay, we have the last picture. Okay, so observe. What is this picture? Okay, very good. Um, Jerry, 
Okay, so this picture is birthday. Okay, very good. Okay, so now I will ask you a question. So which of the following is a person? Okay, which of the following is a person? Okay, very good. The girl is a person. Okay. Another. So which of the following, so which of this picture is a place? Okay, we have um, Jeff. Okay, very good. School. School is a place. Okay, so another, which of this picture is a thing? Who can answer? Just raise your hand. Okay, Argel, okay, very good. A thing, a pencil is a thing. Okay, very good. So another, if so, which of this picture is animal? Okay, we have, okay, very good, chicken. This chicken is an animal. Okay, very good. So another, which of the following or which of these pictures is an event? Who can guess? Okay, Jella. Okay, very good. Birthday. Birthday is an event. Okay, very good. Clap your hands. Great job, everyone. Okay, so now my question is, what do we call these words? Okay, um, person, a place, a thing, an, an animal, an event. Okay, very good. So these are nouns okay so as we can see everything around us has a name and with that we're going to talk about naming words or what we called noun okay so but before that we will going to unlock first what is a noun okay so what is a noun class? Okay, so here, a noun is a name of a person, a place, a thing, an animal, or event. Okay, so these are the examples of a noun. Okay, so the girl is a noun. Now, let me give you some examples, okay? So here, for, pers for person, we have boy, girl, doctor, teacher, farmer, Sally, Jeff, John, Mary, and Harry. Okay, so these are the examples of a person. Okay, who can give me another examples? Okay, we have Mary, Mary Jane. Okay, so Brian is a name of a person. Okay, we have... Okay, very good. A policeman. Okay, very good, Michelle. Okay, so Brian and policemen are nouns okay so next we have place so for place we have church hospital school bank house cebu manila japan korea and china 
and another who can give me another example of a place. Okay, we have um, gel. Okay, very good. Canada is a name of a place. Okay, we have park. Very good. Park is a name of a place. Okay, so Canada and park are nouns. Okay, very good. Okay, another we have here thing. So for thing, we have bag, shoes, car, pencil, book, chair, table, wallet, paper, and dress. Okay, so um, try to look around and tell me what you can see. Okay, so we have um, eyeglasses. Okay, that's good to hear Joanne. Okay, another. We have, okay, very good, a chair. Okay, so a chair and an eyeglasses are nouns. Very good. And it is a name of a thing. Okay, so another, we have animal. So for animal, we have dog, cat, monkey, rabbit, bird, snake, lizard, fish, tiger, and zebra. Okay, very good. So can you give me another example of an animal? Okay, very good. We have, okay, so we have Lena. Okay, so crocodile. Okay, very good. Another, okay, goat. Okay, very good. So crocodile and goat is a name of an animal. And so goat and so crocodile, I mean, so crocodile and goat are nouns. Okay, very good. So another, we have event. Okay, so for event, we have festival, birthday, Christmas, New Year, cosplay, is Easter, recital, wedding, labor day, and graduation. Okay, very good. So who can give me another example of event? Okay, very good. Foundation day. Another, we have family day. Okay, very good. So foundation day and family day are example of a name of an event. And foundation day and family day are nouns. Okay, very good. Clap your hands. Okay, great job, everyone. Do you understand now what is a noun class? Okay, very good. So to sum up, let's define again what is a noun. Okay, so a noun is a name of a person, a place, a thing, an animal, or event. Okay, very good. So now, to enhance your learning, I prepared here a 12 words, a 12 different words, and these words are nouns. And I want you to identify which category these words belong. I want you to identify which words belongs to a name of a person, a place, a thing, an animal, or event. Okay, so class, um, write this in a one half sheet of paper. Okay, so I will give you five minutes to answer class and you may start answering now. So are you done class? Okay, very good. So let's check if you got the correct answer. Okay, so very good. 
clap your hands. Um, me I know is perfect. Okay, very good. Almost of you got the perfect score. Okay, great job everyone. Okay, very good. So now I know that you already learned what is noun class. So my question is, why do you think we need to learn noun class? Okay, so we have um, Myrtle. Okay, very good. So we need to learn noun to identify a place, a person, a name of a person, a thing, an animal, or event. Okay, very good. So here's my last question. So who can share their own understanding for today's lesson? Okay, we have um, Robert. Okay, very good, Robert. So, you know what, class? We see nouns everywhere, from our house, to our school, to surroundings. There is noun. Okay, class. So, now we will have another activity. Okay? So, here. Okay, so let me read first the instruction. Okay, so write if the following is a name of a person, place, animal, thing, or event. Okay, so this is a 10 items only class. So I will give you 5 minutes to answer. Okay, so answer this in a half crosswise. Okay, so now class, you may, so okay, you may now start answering. So okay class, are you all done answering the activity? Okay, that's good. So now we're going to check if you got the correct answer. Okay, very good. Clap your hands. You did a great job class. So you are all perfect. Okay, very good. You really listened our discussion earlier. Okay, that's good to hear, class. Okay, so keep it up. Now, I will give you an assignment for you to do at home. Okay, so here I will post this. I will post this assignment here. So, I will read the instruction, class. So, draw and label an example of a person, place, animal, thing, and event. Okay, so that is five point each class. So, that would be a total of 25 points. Okay, I hope that you do it. I hope that you do that in your home class. So, is that clear to everybody? Okay, very good. Now, class, before we end our lesson, let me read to you this quote from Albert Einstein. So education is not the learning of facts, but the training of mind to think. Okay, so teaching students like you, so teaching students like you class or teaching learners like you, it is not just about what you should learn or what you need to learn in terms of academics but it is a matter of how you learn from your own from your own experiences how you use your critical thinking skills to observe things analyze ideas and have reflections or realization so that you can apply that in real life situations or in your daily living always remember that is the essence of education and being a good and educated person. So I hope that you learn a lot for today class about our lesson. Okay, so thank you so much for your presence and for your active participation. You deserve a round of applause. Okay, very good. You did a great job class. Again, this is your teacher, darling, saying bye-bye for now and happy learning. Okay, goodbye, class. God bless and keep safe, everyone.
Bye.